Welcome back to Rome Total War, the Remastered Edition, where we are trying to demonstrate, guys, that we are well and truly the masters of Egypt. More so specifically, we are the masters of uh, everything in the East, as we are knocking back Egypt, taking from them town after town, and just trying to consolidate here in the Middle East and in Asia Minor. So, having done that, they're having recently acquired Jerusalem, and bringing about a uh, wonderful bit of Roman justice to it, what is it they say? The Romans, they make a wasteland and call it peace. Well, uh, God damn it, it's peaceful there today. I mean, look at that there. Yeah, we've got some buildings destroyed, but everyone is happy. I mean, it might be because we've got Manius the Brave in there, and everyone loves him. But, um, I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Anyhow, so we will call it a day and uh, end the turn and see what the computer decides to do next. Uh, okay. Fleet battle. God damn it. God damn it. Look, they're teaming up with Pontus. That's not fair. Alright, that is bullying. If ever I've heard of it, that is bullying. Come on. Okay, not a great start with the old fleet thing. Dacia, still trying to take a crack at us. Coming after Bylazora. Let them come. That's all I say, let them come. Scythia. Alright. Very, very quick end of turn, I see. Now, um... Let's see, so everyone here is retrained. Good. I would like to go and make a move on Sidon. Yes, master. Let's get our spy up here to, to see what we can see. Uh, okay, bring in my spy here. Won't We won't be able to see anything because of these mountains. So let's see if they've got anything up this way. So nothing there. That is that fills me with confidence. Your honor. What about here? Loud and clear. Okay. Yeah, so they got some forces. They got some big forces. Can we do this? We have like three legions. Four would be nice. Catapults would be nice. These guys would be nice. But we can't take these guys out of here because of our older Captain Amasis. Although he does have just trash there. In fact, you know what? You know what? That's 1,100 men. We've got... a thousand. We could take these guys on. I mean, Nubian spearmen are not that spectacular. Oh, but... Now, it might be wiser to do it if we had a, uh, a general here. Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll let them come to us. We don't, we don't need to rush there. We don't need to rush. Meanwhile, you guys, I think we need to get a move on. We can't just keep dilly-dallying here. I say we make a move on Sidon. What do you guys think? Are they going to come for us? If so, they'll send one unit at a time. We can perch ourselves on a hill and just defend. I mean, that's pretty good, right? I mean, I think that's pretty good. Let's let's try it. Attack! Begin the siege! And the thing is, if they don't come at us, then uh, we'll take Sidon. So we're kind of forcing their hand in this regard. Let's let's get a few more units here just to uh, bolster our forces. Uh, what would be good? Arab archers, they may be. Yeah, we'll get some of those. Peltas might be good. Hang on, we're one, two, three, four, five, six horses. We'll get some of those guys for skirmishing. Uh, and maybe some Peltasts, are they good? Bonus versus elephants. They don't have elephants. They've got, they've got chariots, okay. If these things are good, if these guys are good against chariots, then I want a few of them. Okay, let's do that. Meanwhile, Titus Julius. So I've had to take him out of Alexandria. I've given him two legions, and we're gonna see if we can sneak up north, okay? No one say anything. I wanna land him right here, because there's a settlement there. No one say anything. Don't spill the beans or anything. Uh, let's get rid of you. Oh god, Egypt just sent their biggest navy after us, haven't they? 
fleet ready. I mean, my guys are miles away. Ready to sail. And, uh, yeah, we can't really do much there. We can bring you guys in. And retrain you. And, uh, we'll get another fleet ready. unit of navy there. Uh, meanwhile, over here, what else is going on? You guys come down here. Uh, Tertius Victor, get back in there. Just trying to get the population built up a bit. So we'll just disband you guys. There we go. How many are we at now? 5,100, that's fine. Uh, okay, the Empire is looking pretty good. You guys could do with a bit of a retrain. So, come down here. Yeah, everyone can get a retrain today. Uh, Queso, come up that way, buddy. Alright, I think we can start, yes, we can start training some early legionary cohort here, excellent. So yeah, let's start pumping them out. The thing about this place is, um, we have, uh, two experienced chevrons for them. For any unit we train there, so we want that. Just keeping an eye on, on our old frenemies, the, uh, the Gauls. They're not up to anything silly. And even if they were, it doesn't matter, we can, we can withstand them. Okay, now here. I think in old Placus, he did so well in that bridge battle, I think he wants further glory. So I'm gonna bring him up north, and uh, see if he'd like to make a crack at uh, old Lovavise. Because for a while, I've been looking at my empire, and it's nice and all, and I hadn't really meant to attack the Dacians at all, but since they made a move on us, I think it's fair game. And I have noticed that uh, we've got old Vicus Gothi here, that is our northernmost uh, yeah, our northernmost territory, I'd say. But, um, anyone coming out from there, or going to there, has to go all this long way around. And I think that's a bit, uh, inconvenient. So let's uh, see if we can join things up by relieving the Dacians of these two settlements. So we'll do that. Can we get any units? No. We're good. Alright, that is fine. Uh, they've laid siege here. Yeah, that's... Ooh, they've got a catapults. Interesting. Most interesting. Well, I mean, okay. If they want to, uh, they want to play that game. They can. Yes. Move. Get you guys in Thessalonica. Get you in Athens. I've also just been moving some generals about. All right. Maybe this is what we wanted. Egypt are coming for us. Okay, they've got two decent stack armies. One of which is half trash, the other is a quarter trash. Or rubbish, as we say here in the UK. Now. Now, 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 now. Do we turtle and let them come to us? I mean, I think that, that would be the, the wise thing to do, right? On the field, we can... Well, okay, well, firstly, let's do some shuffling about of the old units. I think that is more important. Okay, so I've done a bit of uh, shuffling about and retraining here. Now we're going to be taking this army, and I think we're going to do it. We're going to crash into these guys and take them out. But the thing is, I think we might have to do this one at a time. Because uh, we don't want to... We want to win. Oh, it's saying we could even do it. Like, that is how much trash it is reading as these guys is having. Do we want to... I thought we might have been able to pull them into a night battle, but it doesn't look like it. But that might not be necessary. Okay, just hold on a second. Uh, so we have space for three more. So... Let's see, that's all trash. That is all trash. Uh, we could use some more... Yeah, for, for sure, we could use some more ranged units. So... What about Cav? One, two, three... Could use some more Cav. Alright. I'll send you guys. You jump in the city. And now... Let's do it. Roughly evenly matched with this army, but, uh... Yeah, these, these guys do have reinforcements coming in, but if we can... 
Maybe smash one and then move on the other? I don't know, but we'll see. Old Sexy Rex has a big job ahead of him, but we can do it. This is a fully stocked army. I think we can do this. Let's let's make it happen. All right, let's get right to it. Big old cavalry battle start. Awesome stuff. Move on to the Axemen. All right, excellent. All right, keep it going, guys. Keep it going. How are we doing on that general? Uh, we've got Pharaoh's Guards. Pharaoh's Guards could be a bit problematic. Let's see if we can do some work against them. Okay, good. That's one. Oh, man. These guys hurt. Look at them, they're just steady. Good god. Alright, I... no. The gods be praised! The enemy general is dead! Oh, so He's weak. Dead. No, enemy general dead. Approaches. I will take it. I will gladly take it. Alright, we need to just wreck some of these guys now. Okay, guys there are taking some heat. Alright, this is the stuff I was afraid now. This is the stuff I was afraid of. The chariots. Okay, but even the chariots are breaking. That's good. Though they have dealt a lot of damage to us. Alright, our lines are crumbling over there, which is not good. Let's see if we can get our general involved. Um, well, maybe not, actually. We have to think about their general. Alright, awesome stuff. Brilliant victory there. Can we get him down to 15% though? I hope so. Alright, outstanding stuff. And that is, uh, that's the kind of victories we want.
That is exactly the kind of stuff we want. Oh, he got away. Victory and glory! Alright, that's fine. That's not the end of the world. Hmm. And they've still got stuff with which to throw at us. And, hang on, did I read that correctly? So... Are Egypt and Pontus... They are, they're allies. Oh, okay. I mean, of course. And... The Seleucids, they're still around. Interesting. Very interesting, okay. Well, I had thought that these two were at odds, but actually if they're working together, then that really doesn't help us, does it? No, it doesn't. Okay, well, I say we, we, we should probably th consider turtling here. Or at least uh, recovering some of these units a bit. Because uh, we did take a few knocks. Okay, everyone here is looking good. Uh, let's take a look at our naval situation. So we can't move you back. That is a darn shame, isn't it? You guys are moving forward. Where can we retrain you guys then? In Siwa, maybe? No. He was a bit angry. Uh, what about here? Oh yeah, I was ferrying units up this way, wasn't I? Yeah, so let me do that. You guys wanted to go to Petra. And then I wanted to move this legion up slowly. Judea is not thrilled. Uh, let's give them some more archers. And then they should be thrilled. And here... Yeah, we, we just let Siege with this turn, didn't we? Okay, so... We've got the uh, the King of Egypt in there. The old Pharaoh. Tanu Tamun, the Builder. Well, let's uh, bury him among his buildings. So, um, yeah, I think that's all we can do this turn. Let's uh, see what the computer decides to do, and uh, call it... Actually, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Xeraxis. He looks pretty good. 22 years old, 2 stars. Now, I'm a bit annoyed with the Dacians. Because, uh, I mean, we were their allies, and then they betrayed us. So, I think it's only fair if we are at liberty to engage in total warfare against them, right? That makes sense, right? Now, total warfare in my book means deploying your strongest unit against the enemy. So now my strongest unit is the Diplomat. Yes. So, uh, yeah, Xeraxes. Be quick. Our patience is limited if we may have a private word. Well, Welcome to the squad. When you put it like that. Yeah, when we put it like that. Okay, so now we have a... Uh, a new friend on our team. Well done. And that is how we deal with annoying Dacians. Okay, we'll uh, call it a turn and see what the computer does next. Oh, well, what are the Senate up to? Oh, okay, so they've come there. Pergamum. Can we repel them, though? Oh god, I didn't move you guys! Crud! Well, that actually helps. Because uh, now you guys are closer to uh, a, a port. Okay, the Egyptians are getting antsy. What about the Dacians? No, bumbling, sending units about. When we relieve them of uh, two of their towns, the northern towns, then uh, yeah, then we'll see how they feel. All right. In fact, I think we'll do that right away. So, go on, Placus. Yeah, there's nothing in there. That should be a quick one. A very quick engagement. Uh, here. Yeah, they could come as an, come at us next turn. That'll be fun. Orders. Uh, you get into Thessalonica. Yes. You. 
uh, come down to Larissa. What more pirates? Are you serious? Ready to sail. I don't like pirate. Was my oh, it's you guys. I was moving you guys east, wasn't I? Okay, 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 okay. Admiral Tertius. Set sail. How'd you like some of that? Aye, Captain. In fact, two hundred and eight would. Aye, Captain. Could you guys? I mean, maybe. No, actually, have have them come up north. Have you guys retrain? Like so. And have Nero get rid of them. Yeah, I, th I like that. Alright, so they didn't come at us, the old uh, Egyptians. That's fine. But um, one thing at a time. They're trying to sneak a, uh, an army through the mountains here. And maybe come around the back and uh, trap us like that. So I say, if we can take this town now, then that puts us in a very good position. Why haven't they taken made a move on Bostra? I don't get that. I'm not sure, but uh, let's make a move on Sidon. Ooh. This could be a quick auto. Yeah, that was alright. Unfortunately, we're going to have to exterminate. Because I'm not having rebellions here. And, uh... Yeah, we can retrain all of this stuff, which is awesome. Uh, let me do some shuffling about of units. Okay, good stuff. Let's retrain everything there and get an arena on the go. And uh, we're in a good, uh, we're in a good position. So down here, do you guys need anything? Maybe. What do we want in Jerusalem? Maybe. There's not not much, is there? Okay, you guys, Titus Julius. Let's see what they got. Oh, this could be good. What? Attack. God damn it, I thought Be I could. Ready. Oh, for crying out loud. Ready to sail. Okay, we'll get Cyprus in a second, Old Salamis. But this is a golden ready opportunity that's sail. here. We could just plunk him outside the town. Yeah, that could be great. Alright, we'll think about that in a second. Meanwhile, down here. Uh, Captain Neferet. He's just got trash. We've got archers. Yeah, this could be a quick draw out. Let's uh, do that. Get rid of some of their numbers. Oh yeah, cake. All right, I think we did a uh, fair bit of damage to them there. Knocked out a fair few of their chariots, and uh, sniped a few uh, Nubian spearmen. So uh, let's call it a day. This was yeah, a that's draw. an acceptable draw. Them losing way more men than us is definitely an acceptable draw. Okay, so yeah, it doesn't really matter if they come at us next turn. But, I mean, they won't. But... Even if they did, it doesn't matter. Uh, you guys are okay? Alright. Decision time. Sexy Rex. What are you gonna do? They've got elephants. Jeez. They have got elephants. Hmm. Now, uh, they don't have much in terms of, uh... Decent force around Ankara. Now, my question is, if we attack this guy, is that going to bring the Egyptians in? I wonder. Okay, let's just, let's just put a pin in that for a second. 
All right, I think I've come to a decision. I think it is worth us trying. Now, here's what I'm thinking, right? We take a crack at old um, Romataclius of Gangra, of Gangrene, the factioneer. He is either going to stand and fight because he's got the Egyptians as backup, or he's going to run away. If he runs away, we're going to run headfirst into old Hekmet and Alexander Wannabe. Now, Hekmet, he doesn't have too, too much that we need to concern ourselves with. Mainly the elephants, though. Though, uh, if we can snipe him, or maybe arch him down with our onagers, then uh, he will prove to be not a thing at all. Now, I did see these guys, mercenary peltests. They'll be good against chariots and elephants. So I say we get some of these, and we get some, uh, some old Thracians to, uh, yeah, just, um, help a bit with, uh, our numbers. And uh, I think, yeah, that puts us in a good stead. So let's do that there. If not him, then him. The thing is, if him, is he gonna bring in him? Let's find out. Oh, he's gonna stand and fight. Okay. I'll have it. I will have it. Let's go. Oh, actually. No, we want old Mechmed to come in. Let's do it. This is the episode where we have to start deleting big Egyptian armies, and I think we're off to a good start, so let's do it. Those scythe chariots. How they hurt. God, come on. God, our, our horses are running. Here we go, we got him. We got him. Alright, let's get that general. You guys, fire at will. Oh boy. Okay, uh, help us get up there after the, uh... After the... Elephants. Come on, we need to take the general down. Our lines are crumbling. Their general's running, that's good. The enemy general is running away. This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, right. you guys, can you get onto that elephant? Where is our general going? Alright, aim for the Egyptian general, please. Oh, sweet. The elephants are running. Awesome stuff. Absolutely awesome stuff. Alright, you guys come back. Uh, Peltusts. Where are the archers? Alright, you guys should be here. God damn it, what are you guys doing all the way over there? Right, awesome. So the uh, the elephants are running amok and uh, giving chase to them. Alright, Thracians, you're gonna come here and form a line. 
because uh, we don't really have much of a line there. Let's get you guys in there. Good, good, good. Okay, they are not liking things. This is how I like my Egyptians, in disarray. Okay, let's keep the archer fire going. Aim for that general. Uh, what is this here? Arab cavalry. We can take them. You guys come around there. Honestly, these peltas. Okay, put you in guard mode. Excellent. That Arab cavalry is running away. Well, you guys move forward a bit. We'll get better shots on the general. Where do you guys come out of there? Hunt to keep the cavalry. The light cavalry they got. Oh. God, our guys are not in a good way. Okay, we are doing well. We're doing excellent work. Ten of them left. Let's go. We can kill that guy. Then that is exactly what we want. We're evenly matched. Now it all comes down to who wants it more. Rations are over there. The enemy oh, so weak. That is huge. That is huge. Alright, guys, feel free to arch down whomever you want. Uh, what have they got here? They've got. Uh, Cav Bedouin archers, Hunter Cav mercenaries. Okay, nothing too spectacular there. Let's give them the old poke poke. I mean, now that their general's dead, they'll be shaken, they'll be really not in the mood for any of this. Oh, excellent. Some of them are running already, that's good. Are you guys in skirmish mode? Excellent. This is where we see the routes. Like, this ought to be our victory now, right? It's not up to us to prove that we can beat them. It's up to us. It's up to them to prove that they cannot lose. Or at least that's, that's what I tell myself. All right, let's see if we can get these Bedouin archers. Okay, we, we smashed these Nubian spearmen, and I think we've got them, because the rest is just all trash. So yeah, let's get these guys to rout. Excellent. Yeah, they are going for it. They are making a run for it. They've had enough. Oh, yeah. Brilliant. Go on, guys. Give chase. This is exactly what we wanted. Alright, you come back. Just chill a bit. You've done enough. That's what I'm talking about, guys. That is what I'm talking about. And glory! 
Okay, that was, uh, brilliant. Once again, I know I'm saying that a lot, but, uh, that was good. Now we are definitely gonna have to do some, uh, shuffling about of units here. Uh, how can we do this? Okay, I think I'm gonna try something. I've just put two of my spies in the town, and if we get rid of the Onagas, maybe... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Gotta love my spies. And look at that there, we can get in straight away. Ho ho, isn't that great? That is wonderful. So now into the town we go. Victory and glory! Settlement captured! Alright, now they don't really have much here. Hmm. Uh, well, might as well enslave them. Uh, we can repair the walls. And in terms of this army, I will have to pull you guys over there somewhere. If you get attacked, they get attacked. Not great, but not the end of the world. Now this army, this army can just basically turtle here. Imperator. So we can see, can we get any other units? Oh, no. Imperator. No, we can't. That's okay. Because us defending this town is easier than us fighting these guys and getting rid of them on the field. Which is, uh, yeah, I think the way uh, we ought to be doing it. Now, we just have some armies behind us here that we need to deal with, and we will be in a good, uh, in good stead. But, uh, before that, let's just deal with the Dacian problem up here. Uh, oh no, I only put it to the sword this turn, didn't I? Hmm. Oh, okay, finally, maybe we should just do a bit of, uh, sniping here. Yeah, let's just get rid of some of these numbers quickly. Oh, wait, it looks like they're withdrawing. Okay. I mean, well, that's fine with me. Yeah, looks like they didn't want to stand and fight. Absolutely fine with me. Okay, so they withdraw back to here. Which does mean that Nicomedia is in the firing line next, so we need to be a bit mindful of that. What can we get? Let's get uh, some horses. Actually, yeah, we do need some horses, don't we? Okay, some horses, and uh, then we're in a good, uh, good way. Here, you guys can all retrain. Uh, wait, 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 wait. There you go. Okay, retrain, and then on to... Uh, what do we need? Archers, maybe? Let's get some archers. Okay, the question is, if the faction heir, if the old prince of Egypt decides to come down this way, can this force relieve or, or yeah, supply, uh, su support what's up that way? Actually, here in Helicarnassus, I don't really think we need legionary cohorts down there, do we? So I'm going to move you guys up. You're not thrilled. We'll lower the taxes, and you're fine. Yeah, because I'd, leave, I'd like you guys to come and support and reinforce the guys in Ankara. And then uh, this force can just wreck absolutely everything in this area. And we can have a, not just a foothold, but we can just be masters of uh, this eastern edge. No, this western edge of, uh, of Asian Minor. Yeah, right, so it all depends on what the, uh, faction air does next. Uh, but yeah, that's a turn, let's... ...do it. Okay, you guys are coming up to Jerusalem. Fine with me. We'll have to send all the Manius... ...to intercept- oh god, no! Sweet! Alright, Pontus. Yeah, so Pontus is still very much a presence in the game. Dacia. Playing around with the old spies. 
Okay, so they're still raising more forces and sending them at us. I don't like that. I do not like that. Okay, another happy turn. Uh, okay, they've just sent trash that way, and they've sent the Prince of Egypt back toward Ankara. Now, we could... This might be an opportunity to uh, knock him out. We do have the manpower. So I suggest we think about that. These guys... Can Zaraxxus get rid of these guys? Probably not. Okay, but I do have some backup units coming down this way. Uh, so let's get you all on the boat. And over to Nicomedia. Right, now that is a reinforced town. I am happy with that. Uh, we've got horses, we've got archers, we have got infantry, yes. This here can hold off all of that jazz, no problem. Okay, over here. You guys get in the town. Uh, you get back into port. Okay, so you guys have broken the siege, it's fine. Uh, let's just retrain all of you guys, and... Get maybe another unit of legionaries. Uh, down here, where we, we were okay, we were sending you to Thessalonica, and we're sending you. Uh, we're sending you down to Larissa, right? Okay. All right. Pirates. What can we do about the pirates? Take care of those pirates, please. Over here, Admiral Tertius. Okay. Now, this is a, uh, a navy. There we are. Victory! Now, let us just prove why we... why we are the masters of the sea. Uh, Pontus, you can... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Lovely. Okay, and keep at it. Brilliant stuff. Alright, get you guys into port. Can you retrain? No, you can't. That's okay. We weren't necessarily planning to. Uh, but now, anything we bring across here, navy-wise, we can we can deal with this stuff. Yeah, this is all just small-scale, all trash. Absolutely fine with us. Right, now over here. This is what we've been waiting for. Titus Julius. Uh, we need you to come here. Oh, don't you wanna... Okay. Lay siege to them. If they wanna come at us, let them come. Otherwise, we are good. Now, let's see. In terms of, um... Ports... Egypt have that, and of that. Is that all they've got? One, two, and three. If that's the case... Then, uh... We might have solved our little n naval problem. Send you guys up there. And send you guys over there. I mean, I think, yeah, we, we might very well have uh, solved our naval issues if, if that's the case. Uh, you guys will just send you to relieve Jerusalem. In fact, I think maybe we can do a draw out here quickly. Let's Let's try it very quickly. Just snipe a few of them, you know how it is. Quickly. Yeah, I'll have that. I mean, we've just killed over a thousand of their men. That is a, a decent draw out.
And the uh, the really cool thing is, I was actually thinking of uh, of all getting old um Apius Arianus to come down here and get rid of these guys, but now I don't even really think I need to do that. Like these archers can withhold can hold out against these guys for at least another turn and then some. So um yeah I'm I'm happy there. That is a good start. Meanwhile up here. Now are we going to be using this to push forward? The Egyptians have still got a lot of stuff over there. They're still not quite ready to sue for peace. It's okay. So, keep that under um, siege in Lovovice. Let's do this. Yeah, so this should be a quick auto. Okay, good. Alright. Bohemia is now ours. Uh, no. Okay, we learned, haven't we? We have learned, so we're just gonna repair that. And we're gonna just, just we're gonna destroy all this trash. Uh, can't destroy that. Yep, we are not subjecting ourselves to culture penalties for all the stuff, for all this unnecessary stuff, so let's do away with that entirely. Uh, what do we want? Temple to Jupiter? Okay. And now, where's my spy? I'd like to see what they have here. Or nothing too much. I might have to do a little bit of an exodus of troops and get, uh... Yeah, maybe get some peasants down that way to a bolster the population. And just get it growing a bit, so let's do that. Uh, and then you guys can make your way further north. Uh, we'll leave some Peltas behind. Are they gonna be okay? They'll be okay. It'll probably be alright, right? It will probably be alright. Alright, drop another watchtower. And let's go after the next one. Okay, unfortunately, this is what the Dacians get for messing with us. But uh, this will put our... This will put a nice... Uh, ready to sail. Fleet ready. This will add a nice happy edge to our borders. Alright, round here. You guys, we've dealt with you. You guys... Yeah, just uh, sink the remnants of that. Here, hunt them down, please. Nicomedia, you fine. You know what you guys are up to next. Uh, one, two, three. Do you need more horse? I would feel a little bit more comfortable if you had a little bit more horse. Alright, over here. Actually, 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 this is what we said we'd do, isn't it? Well, we can't now, because we just reinforced them. But here. Now, if they decide to come after... We don't have any archers there. Huh. We don't have any archers. And unfortunately, our archers can't get out of Pergamum and get back to Sardis in time. So, here's what I suggest. The last thing we do for this turn, we go and smash the Prince of Egypt, and then... Like, this year, this is going to be trash. What is it? Okay, maybe, maybe not. This is trash for sure. But basically, the Prince of Egypt, the Factioneer, is all that stands between... Like, this is the last... A lot of decent stuff that they've got. If we can absolutely smash this army, then they've got nothing here. Like, this year, we, we can deal with all this here. Nicomedia is fully reinforced, reinforced. They can deal with all that jazz. So, yeah, I think our last act of... Uh, Pushing back against the Egyptians in this Asia Minor, our last significant one at least. Like, this is the decisive battle now. This one. And I think we can do it. Let's do it. Engage the enemy. Yeah, roughly evenly matched. We can do this. Send it. 
Whoa! Didn't see you guys. Okay, they've got some cavalry on their extreme right here. We uh, managed to get rid of them though. That's good. Alright, now, aim for that general. You know what it is, guys. You know what it is. The horses have run away. Guys, come around here. into those chariots. Come on, guys. Come on. Get Freddy a general. We're doing well. I want the Prince of Egypt dealt with. Oh god. Chariots. They're gonna hurt. They are just missile chariots, but they could still very, very much hurt. Okay. Here we go. Our chariots, our horses are gonna have to intercept. we take on the general? If we can snipe the general, do it. Please, come on, guys. Okay, skirmishes are running. General's getting hurt. Come on. Oh, so weak. So weak. The enemy general is slain. And now his men fear us. It is time to Oh, test brilliant. All right, guys. Awesome stuff. Absolutely awesome stuff. Give chase. Yeah, they're withdrawing. They've had enough. Well, I say you had enough when I say you've had enough. Okay, I think uh, they might have gotten a few more than the old 15% away. Yeah, so they might have... the army still might have mostly... Well, some of them still might have uh, gotten away from us. But... We did what we came to do. The Prince of Egypt is no more. Yeah, that's it. They can just run out of there. Excellent. And our guys can now chill in Ankara. Oh, this is awesome, guys. This is absolutely awesome. We're just taking town after town after town away from the Egyptians. Uh, Alright, well... I mean, as we're on a bit of a roll... Nothing else to do there. Good. Alright, let's call it a turn. And... See what the computer does. Uh, spies, merchants dead. Yeah, we don't care about merchants. Okay, here we go. The last remnants of Egypt in Asia Minor coming at us. Doesn't matter. But look, they've still got stacks in reserve. This is the thing. This is why we we have to be so aggressive with Egypt. Because even though it might look like we're just committing some kind of Egyptian genocide, we, we don't actually under... We, we kind of underestimate just how big of a force they are. Because they're, they're, they're quite significant. Bound the defenses. Okay, more pirates. Interesting. Now here... 
Xeroxus the Wrathful, what can we do with you? Basically, this is going to be an interesting draw out, because uh, we can't... Yeah, we don't have any archers, so that's going to be fun. That is going to be fun. Okay, but... But, but, but... Oh, come on, look. I swear the game just gifts them more and more generals. Sir. Anyhow... General. Titus Julius, you came to do a job. Go do your job, sir. Yeah, this is an too easy auto. And Salamis is ours. Settlement captured. Uh, I feel like Titus is the kind of guy who would uh, exterminate the population. So I'm just um, trying to keep it consistent with him. We'll build large stone walls. And... What is this army going to do next? Could go up against him. In fact, we will in just a bit. But no need to rush that. Uh, we'll just, uh, yep, get you guys over there. Get you guys there. And, uh, in fact, now we can start moving these guys up, I think. Wait, can we? Let's see if we can get you, you guys up. Yeah, they're not... Okay, yeah, they're not too, too upset about that. Alright, okay, I'll, I'll move up the legionaries. Like, these guys are the, the main ones. We can break the siege. Those guys are small potatoes. And, uh, yeah, I think the situation in the east is, uh, slowly coming together. Get rid of you. Lovely jubbly. Okay. And, uh, finally... Imperator. Wait, can we... Searching for clues. 32% chance our spy can open. Can we do it? Can he do it? Engage for Placus. He Begin can't do it. God damn it. No Set worries. Fine, we'll put that under siege sir. and we will get that next turn. And uh, I think uh, this is a good place to leave it, guys. We'll, uh, this is an easy draw out. No worries. These guys can bumble about all they want. They can keep sending general after general against us, but... You know, we can we can keep dealing with them. Like, they are not a problem. The Dacians are not an issue at all. Lord, move. In fact, when I take the next town, I might actually let them become our vassals. Because they've been through enough this playthrough. And I feel like everyone deserves a second chance, and they deserve a second chance to become our bitches. So, um, yeah, I think I might extend the olive branch. Anyhow, having uh, expanded here in Asia Minor, having acquired Salamis, Old Cyprus, and, uh, Having destroyed a n like several armies of uh, of Egypt, including the Prince of Egypt himself, we are now in a very very good position. Like we we were a little bit on the edge before, but uh, like because we had uh, some armies scattered about here in Nicomedia and Pergamum, but now for sure we have consolidated. This stuff here shouldn't be too too big uh, of, of an issue. The only problem is we just don't have any archers, but that's absolutely fine. These guys are just gonna have to get stuck in. They don't have a general, which means. Yeah, absolutely, uh, it, it, it shouldn't be too, too much of a difficult situation. Gotta watch out for this munchkin, though. But, I mean, as you can see, this is the thing with the Egyptians. Like, they either have outstandingly spectacular, excellent units, like royal, uh, royal guard and whatnot, royal infantry, like chariots that hurt, or they've got absolute trash. And, uh, yeah, I'm not too, too worried about the trash. But um, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Take care.